As a dentist, you know the science shows that dental amalgam is a safe, affordable, and durable restorative material for your patients. But what effect does amalgam waste have on the environment? According to the EPA, less than 1% of mercury released to the environment from human activity comes from dentistry. Yet wastewater conditions vary across the country. Communities in a number of states already have regulations in place that require dental offices to install amalgam separators to capture amalgam waste at the source and recycle it. The EPA has issued a federal regulation requiring amalgam separators in dental offices across the country. So now is a good time to learn about this issue. To help our members be good stewards of the environment and to help them comply with both regulatory requirements and the ADA's best management practices, the ADA offers two great resources, best management practices for amalgam waste and an ADA business resources endorsed amalgam separator with collection and recycling services provided by Health First at exclusive members only pricing. Standard dental office equipment captures up to 80% of amalgam waste and most of the remaining 20% is captured at wastewater treatment plants. However, adding an amalgam separator can allow an office to capture at least 95% of amalgam waste in order to recycle it. Learn more about what your office can do to help protect the environment and comply with applicable regulations. Visit ada.org slash separator for more information on amalgam best practices.